Hello, um, we're just going to run through the how to do the coding um, on the VCDS for an Audi A5. Mine's a Cabriolet TDI, but a 2013, but I should think it'll be pretty much the same um, for any other models of this era, Audi models. Um, I've added cruise control. As you can see, the, the switch is in there. Um, there's plenty of videos on how to actually take your steering wheel and everything everything and fit the switch if you haven't got one uh, so I'm not going to go over that just the coding so you open your VCDS um, click on select for control module then click on engine just wait for it to uh grey all the boxes then click coding and then what you do on the, this version you click long coding helper and if you just uh, click up now until number five on the left-handed blacked out box uh, yeah bits five and six sorry five not bits five and six there in this drop down menu that's for your cruise control so if you haven't fitted it before you it'll say the cruise control not installed you need to change that to cruise control installed and then all you do is close that box and then click on do it wait a few seconds and a box will click up that the coding's accepted um, and that's that one done but that the, the reason I've done this video is I've found um, the next bit wasn't really explained on uh, anywhere I found it on Google anywhere so you have to put the code in in a second place so close that controller you also have to go to steering wheel same thing again go to code in click on long, long helper again And then you'll get a similar box and you just go up to number two in the black box this time and you've got the same thing again here look it says cruise control installed because I've already done it but it'll say not installed you've got to pick installed and then you you close that once you've picked selected installed click do it same thing again it come up the coding is uh, accepted and that should be a cruise control working I couldn't find anything on the net anywhere to say to do that second bit in the steering wheel part uh, so I got the uh, the light flashing um, on the on, for the glow plug light flashing to say this is some sort of an error and of course the cruise control didn't work and just to check every, just to check your switch is working what you can do go back to engine wait a few seconds again and this is slightly different on this version of VCDS as well. Click on advanced measuring values there. And in the box up here at the top, just type in cruise. If you can spell it. Yeah, uh, you'll get a list of everything that says cruise in it. So just pick these two. Um, cruise control system, CCS, stasis bits and the switch position. Um, so we look at those now, at the moment my switch is off, so if I just turn it on, it's, you see it's reading no at the bottom number, turn that on and it'll change to 129 and then you should, whichever direction you push it in, you should get a change in value, so you know, 133, 137, 161, 131 and then the set button at the end, change it to 145 and back to off again. And just click it back on and then your pedals if you just press your brake pedal the top one will change with that one you get a one and then a three if you press it hard uh, and then you'll get a, a four I mean it's all done in binary but uh, obviously that's it's just to, just to check everything's working so if all that's working drive your car off your cruise control should be working fine I hope this helps somebody out there thank you very much bye